It's been hiding underground for thousands of years, but now we're getting a close-up look at a mammoth beast that was discovered right here in West Michigan. Back in November, Eric Witzke was having a pond dug in his backyard in Bellevue Township. It was a simple project that soon opened up a prehistoric portal. It was just amazing to see these bones and the size of these bones, you know, coming up out of the ground. Contractor Daniel LaPointe was doing the digging. It was just something different, and I, and I just automatically just assumed dinosaur. It just, that's what popped into my head. LaPointe and Witzke dug up a total of 42 bones. Putting the bones together painted a clear picture of the huge creature. It was a mastodon. I'm speechless because it's just, just a once in a lifetime find. They brought in an expert from the University of Michigan. He determined the bones were from a 37 year old male mastodon, between 10,000 and 14,000 years old. You stop and you think that these things were walking around here. Mastodons are related to elephants, weighing about five tons. He had thought the mastodon had been butchered. You know, humans had cut it up, utilized the pond area for their refrigerator. The mastodon has been getting lots of attention, becoming a local celebrity. Now that he's done hiding, they're thinking of putting him to good use, donating bones to museums and schools. I was that kid that was standing on the other side of the rope that wanted to touch these things. And now I can, and I want other kids to have that opportunity to be able to touch them. In the spring, they're planning a dig to find more pieces of history. Some people find oil. We were lucky to find uh, mastodon bones. 330 mastodon bone sites have been discovered in Michigan, so you might want to check in your own backyard. Reporting in Eaton County, Aaron Dimmick, News Channel 3.